Good morning, Larry. Good morning, sir. There's going to be a lot of trains passing through this yard in the next few weeks, and I'm calling in another engine to help you keep up with the heavier workload. I can manage fine by myself. Your track record suggests otherwise. They should be here by the end of the week. I have to finish making the arrangements, but I wanted to let you know. All right. Oh, yes, and I need them here by the end of the week. Oh, splendid. You have one available for Friday. I... Really? Um, are there any other options? I see. He's the only engine you can send? All right. Send him over. I'll have the papers over by Wednesday. Goodbye. Well, um, hopefully that didn't make things worse. Have no fear, Samson is here. I was told Sir Topham Hatt needed help keeping an eye on Lazy Larry. So, naturally, I was happy to lend my great strength to assist. <gasps> and look at you. So lazy, you're not even on the rails! Uh, yeah, my name's not Larry, mate. <laughs> what are you talking about? It says Larry right there. Uh, oh, <clears throat> I see. Carry on then! Over here, man. Larry, I presume? Yeah. Sir Topham Hatt sent me to keep an eye on you. Since you've been nothing but lazy from what I've heard. I heard your whole spiel already, dude. I am the strongest engine on Sodor. So if you choose to slack off again, it'll be no issue for me to do the work of two engines at once. I don't need your help, what man. What are you still sitting around for? This yard isn't going to run itself. Chop, chop, let's go. Oh, great, that's just what I need. Cooling again, laddie. I don't know why I'm so surprised. Here I am taking on twice your workload yet again. You're lucky I play by three strikes and you're out. You're at strike one. One is chilling, and no I'm not. Two, three strikes are out, is just called baseball. And three, that siding is for wagons that need repairs, man. Oh, my wheel! <laughs> and you're still sitting there! Strike two! Can one of you please take the garbage train up to the dump? It's sitting in the far siding. I'll do it, sir. And run away to the smelters while nobody's watching you? Ha! No chance. I'll take the train. Very well, Samson. Be off as soon as you can. I expect you'll still be on schedule when I return, Larry. Wouldn't want Sir Topham Hatt finding out about Strike 3, would we? Penny for your thoughts? Oh great, another steamer here to tell me what to do. Oh sorry, I was just saying hello. You looked upset. I just wanted to make sure nothing was wrong. I didn't mean to bother you. You care about how I'm feeling? Sure. No one deserves to be down in the dumps. My name's Rebecca, by the way. You should have said that earlier. 
Whoopsie. That's a bit awkward of me. <sighs> I'm Larry. I'm sorry for snapping at you. I've messed everything up. I can sometimes put off doing my work before I feel like it, and it's caused me nothing but trouble here. I left waste trains in the yard all day. I left my yard unattended so I can go hang out with those stupid ironworks diesels. Sir Topham Hat's definitely gonna get rid of me soon. And then it's back to Burlington for this guy. Everyone makes mistakes, Larry. I messed up a ton when I first came here. And now look at me. Helping Gordon pull the express. One of the most important jobs on the railway. Everyone needs a little time to adjust whenever they first move somewhere. <laughs> Easy for you to say. How could anyone be mad at you? You're one of the nicest engines I've ever met. Ugh, Gordon, though. That's another story. <laughs> Gordon's made his fair share of mistakes too, Larry. Really? Sure. He stalled on hills, fallen into ditches. Don't tell him I said any of that, though. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know any of that. Look, you feeling guilty proves you learned your lesson. Now all you have to do is apply it. Put in the work now and Sir Topham Hatt is bound to notice soon enough. You really think so? Absolutely. Useful is as useful does. Saw it in a poster once. No, no, I get it. Thanks, Rebecca. Appreciate the talk. You're welcome, Larry. <whistles> oh, that'll be me. Goodbye now. See you around. Lazy Larry's working a little too well. <gasps> He's trying to make me look lazy. Oh, that sneaky little. Uh, I'll show him what for. Man, that's a lot of trucks. I can take some of those off your buffers if you want. And make me look like the lazy one. <laughs> nice try, laddie. But I'm wise to your tricks. There's no train too heavy for the strongest engine on Sodor. Seriously, dude, you should sit back and watch, laddie. Ever seen an engine shunt two trains at once? No challenge from me at all. Stop! Huh? On, on, on! That will teach you things around with us. With us. Come on, let's go! <laughs> <Ooh, yeah. laughs> hey! Yay, my first friend! <laughs> Um, not how that was supposed to go. Really? I couldn't even tell. What on earth is this? The express is due soon. There's bound to be delays with this mess on the line. I'll go get help. Attention, 416. What are you doing out on the main line? Leaving Samson to run your yard unattended, boy -o? You guys know Samson? 
Aye, Bradford's his brake van normally, but there wasn't much use to leaving him sitting around in the yard, so he's been doing maintenance work with me. Did something happen to him? Something happened to him, didn't it? You could say that, but I think you guys are just the ones to help. Come on! I knew I should have gone with him! That silly simpleton always causes some form of disorder when I'm not watching him like a hawk. I hope he's alright. Ah, oh, there you are! Gordon's due through with the express in 15 minutes! There's no way we can clean this up before there are delays! <gasps> we have to call down the line and stop that train before I'm squashed! I can get it done before then, sir. What? what? You can barely keep a yard to time! How can you expect to run a rescue that quickly? I work faster than this in Brillington all the time! I promise I'll have the line clear in time for Gordon to come through. For real, dude. Oh, Alright, you better get to work then. <laughs> Express coming through! This train will be passing through Crook in 11 minutes. Hopefully that layabout hasn't left any trucks sitting about on the line. Didn't put anything past him. Ah, good to be back on solid rails again. You're in solid trouble, Samson. How foolish did you have to be to- You have to move off the express line! I'm not in steam! There's going to be a crash! Oh, somebody save me! Buddy, Gordon's on his way in! You won't be able to move him in time! Danger, danger! Violation of Railway Safety Guideline Manual Section! Ah, shut up! <gasps> Get out of the way! me. After all, I... Eh, twas nothing. Useful is as useful does, after all. He's a very hard worker, isn't he? Affirmative, boy -o. Hey, leave it to Larry to surprise us all. I heard you got all the work done without fuss today, Larry. Well done. And my job's too, sir. Oh? What do you mean, Samson? Well, <laughs> you see, sir, a funny thing happened. I, um, was showing off a little and, well, you know how it is, sir. Came off the rails, sir. But uh, Larry saved me. Got the yard from mess to clean in 15 minutes flat! He got me out of the way from getting squashed by the express just in time, sir! Ah, so Gordon wasn't telling tales. You have a lot to learn, Larry, but I'm glad to see you finally taking the initiative. That is what a good leader would do. Someone I can trust to run the yard. Keep up the good work, really useful engine. Thank you, sir. You can count on me. I expect your owner knows your repairs are coming out of his pocket, Samson. Oh, yes, sir. 
Larry is a little hydraulic diesel shunter who keeps the yard at Kronk Central Station organized, taking trucks in and out to make sure the engines can keep the railway running on schedule. He used to try and put off jobs he didn't want to do for later so he could chill in the sun, but having to manage a yard by himself taught him that things are set to time for a reason. Hey, Gordon! Working hard, I hope. Not as hard as me, though. <sighs> Ten trains shunted, a heavy goods train moved all on my own. Maybe I'll be pulling your express next with the rate I'm working. <laughs> Larry's on a roll, baby! He's a hard worker and wants everyone to know it. But he also enjoys his chilling and spending time with friends at the end of a long day. Told you they'd see soon enough. If there's work at Kronk Central that needs doing, leave it to Larry to do it in style. Hey guys, Larry here. What an adventure that was! But my story's wrapped up for now. Let's see what's cracking on the other side of the island. Take it away, man! Full steam ahead! The storm's going to make it worse! Almost there! See you next time in Captain's Calamity!